Sound Design. So what is Pro Audio Workshop Seeing Sound, and is it right for you? I don't know. We're going to talk about it. So Pro Audio Workshop Seeing Sound is my online sound system tuning course for live sound engineers. It's specifically for people like me who do a lot of shows where they are both the A1 and the system tech. So they're setting up their own sound system and they're mixing on it. And so what they're trying to do is get their mix, which already sounds good coming out of the console, to also sound great at every seat in the room. So that's what the course is all about. It's all about everything between the mixer and people's ears and the audience. What I heard from so many people, and the reason I started this course, is these three, three main items here on this page. Number one, improve your confidence and consistency. Everyone's trying to get to a place where they say, I know that if I stand here behind my mix console and I can make it sound great, then I know it also sounds great over there in the balcony or uh, down there in the orchestra or uh, way back there at the end of the field. And number two, I want to make sure I can do that every place I go with every sound system that I work with every day, not just today at this location with this sound system. And you don't want to be the kind of sound engineer that says, I only work with manufacturer X and I only work on shows this size and it has to be this temperature and this time of year and you have all these conditions. No, you want to be the kind of sound engineer that can basically take any set of conditions and turn it into consistency, right? So if Pro Audio Workshop Seeing Sound were a machine, it would be something, you know, with a big funnel at the top where you put in like, uh, you know, a medium-sized theater um, in the middle of the night in January with all these conditions, throwing stuff in there with this kind of speaker and this artist and all these people. And then you like crank it like this and out of the bottom comes the same thing that you did at last night's show, okay? Or something very close. So that's what we're talking about in terms of improving your confidence and consistency. And that is the thing that I think is going to help you get more jobs and grow your career and grow your business. Number two, the second most important reason why I created this course is to allow you to work at your own pace from anywhere in the world. Time and time again, uh, I hear from people that they want to study sound system tuning, but they can't, number one, take off a week from work and lose that income uh, and then spend money on travel, number two, and then um, maybe spend money on whatever course they're going to take. So you add all those things together and it ends up being um, unsustainable for a lot of people. It's just not really an option. So I said, okay, how can I try and deliver this to you so that it's online, so you can do it from anywhere in the world and basically work at your own pace? And that's why Proto Workshop Seeing Sound all the lessons are online and you have lifetime access to all of them. So I don't care if it takes you two weeks to get the entire course done or six months or five years. You could do a lesson a day. You could do a lesson a week. The thing that's important to me about your work in Priority Workshop Seeing Sound is that you take the time to actually take action. So I want you to take each lesson and then use it in the field so that you learn it and you get it into your hands. And that's how it's gonna really mean something to you because we've all had that experience of going to a seminar or going to a workshop, some kind of training event, and then you get kind of like this download of information and just like pfft, comes down on you for two whole days straight or one day or five days, however long it is. And you get so much information and you feel great at the end of it, right? You feel like I've learned so much. And that's great. And I, I go to those things too, and I get a lot out of it. But then you get home, or you get out into the field, and then all of a sudden you realize, oh, I didn't actually learn anything. I got a bunch of information, but information's not understanding. To actually get understanding, I need experience. I need to actually try these things out. And so this is sort of the, I guess, dissatisfied experience that I've had and a lot of people have had by going to seminars and workshops and then getting home and realizing, oh, I don't quite know how to take action on this stuff. 
That leads me to the third most important reason for this course, which is that this course offers you the highest level of support in the industry. So I'm not talking about, you know, typing your questions into Google when you don't understand something or sending your questions to maybe a forum where other students are going to help you. I'm not even talking about emails where maybe you email me and then I respond to you maybe a day or two later. If you're the kind of person that needs answers now, either to finish your homework or to solve a problem in the field or to work on a design that you need to turn in today, then you'll appreciate this because you will have 24 seven access to me and uh, everyone else, all the other students who, have in, who are in the course, taking it with you to basically get any of your questions answered as quickly as possible. Another really important part of the support here is that you and I will be meeting privately at key points in the course. So definitely at the beginning when you first get started so I can make sure that you're in the right place at the right time. And then there are other key checkpoints along the way so that when you get done with uh, a module, I can make sure that you really got everything out of it that you needed, that you don't have any questions left over. So I talked to you before about how you might go to a two day seminar and you get kind of this information dump and then you go home and you don't know what to do with it. So I'm trying to do the opposite here where you have a longer period of time over which to learn. So let's say that you do the course over six months. Okay. And let's say that along the way you have questions about how do I apply what I'm learning to my work, to my projects? Well, that's where we can meet privately and talk, talk about how to do that. Um, we can discuss it in our online community and that is going to take your confidence and consistency up like this instead of kind of spiking and then coming down and spiking and coming down, which is what my experience has been in the past. So, that's the reason for these three important things. And, and that's why I wanted to spend more time on these at the beginning of this video here. All right. So let's take a look at some more things here. Um, on the page here, there's a questions box. If you ever have a question for me while you're looking at this page, feel free to open it up and type that in. And if I'm awake, I will respond to you. So here I just described the situation that all of us have experienced, which is that your mixing skills get better and better and better. And if you were to put your headphones on straight out of the console, you'd say this mix sounds amazing. I'm great. But then when you go and sit in the audience, you're like, uh, it doesn't sound great here. And when you go and sit up in the balcony, you say it sounds even worse here. And when you go and sit in the front, it's like, everything's different. So there's something happening in between the console and the audience. And that is where sound system tuning comes in. So now we need to start learning about the physics of sound and how we can improve our sound system design and optimization to really deliver that same thing that's coming out of the mix console to all the seats in the audience. This is not just something I made up. This is a story that I've heard from many other people, including um, Merlin Van Veen and Mauricio Ramirez. And I have two stories here from them. Uh, so this is what's funny about our industry, right? Is that it's totally unregulated. So the benefit of that is that anyone can become a sound engineer. You can just say, poof, I'm a sound engineer and you just start working. No one can stop you. The downside is that although there's not a lot of regulation, there's also not a lot of training available for this kind of stuff. And so I just want to point out to you that I don't know how old you are when you're watching this video, but I came to this stuff when I was older, like probably um, around 30, between 25 and 30 is when I started looking into sound system tuning. But now I realize this is actually the first thing you should learn um, because being able to deliver a certain result at a certain position in a room ultimately is something we should be studying at the beginning of our careers and not just how to get things all mixed together in a mix console. Okay. So that's just a tangent. Let's look down farther on the page. Um, here's some people that might be like you struggling with similar situations. Chase is describing the situation we've all experienced uh, where you just feel like you don't have enough time. So that's why one of the very first lessons in the course, I talk about a lot of time saving techniques to get you started. This course is for audio engineers, sound designers, and AV technicians who care about having great shows and want more confidence and consistency in their work. And I really like this quote from Buford Jones to be recognized in this industry. The one thing you must do is to have consistency from night to night and show to show. 
And again, this is this machine I'm talking about where you basically take any room, convention center, theater, or arena, put it into the machine, crank it down, and make it sound good or consistent is more important. Uh, here you're going to get an overview of what's included in the course. So here are the um, some of the main modules. The first module is kind of introductory, getting you set up, getting you taking your first measurements. And then following that, we basically follow the sound system tuning roadmap, which is right down here. So placement, aim, EQ, and then crossover alignment, which is what you see on the sound system tuning roadmap here. So if you are a DIY person, you could basically take this sound system tuning roadmap and teach yourself everything. This course is for the kind of person like me that needs a little bit more help. Okay, you've tried this stuff on your own. Some of it's just not quite making sense, or maybe you just want to move faster. Okay, so that's why I point out here that these are fast paced lessons. There are a lot of lessons. There's 57 or 58, something like that, but each of them is short. In the next videos, when I actually get into looking at the lessons, you'll see that there's an initial video that is maybe four or five minutes long. And then there will be supplemental videos below that that are optional, but you can watch if you need a little bit more help or just want some more examples. Okay, so the course also includes design examples, recordings, templates, worksheets, um, as I mentioned, 24 seven support over our community, uh, through our community, and then a lot of other tips, tricks and hacks along the way. Um, I should point out here that membership in our community is uh, for a limited time. That's the only thing that's limited. So if you buy the normal standard package membership to Priority Workshop Seeing Sound, you're going to get six months of membership in our online community. Um, there's also an accelerated package though that will give you a year long membership in the community. If you're a person that maybe wants to move faster or just want more time to get that support. Nice quote from Mauricio here. He said to me once, you are the first person on the planet to make this more for simple mortals. So I really appreciated that. Okay, so maybe you've tried some of this stuff before on your own. And the reason that it didn't work out for you is that you just didn't have enough support. So pointing out the support again here, uh, this quote from Plato, nothing taught by force stays in the soul. Uh, talk here a little bit about why I created Priority Workshop Seeing Sound. The physics of audio should actually be the first thing people learn, I, I think now. Not something that they then misunderstand down the road and, you know, they set up their sound systems based on a lot of myths, unfortunately. Bunch of great testimonials here. At this point, I've had over 120 people go through the course and a lot of them have gotten a lot of great results. And I'll let you read through some of these if you want, but um, a lot of great guys just like you who might be considering going through here. I'll just read this one. Christopher works at this place called the Wilson Center. And after he worked on the course, he realized, hey, these main arrays that we have, the splay and the aim's not quite right. He adjusted it and the result was, hey, now the people in the front row can hear. Okay, so big improvement there on his uh, house sound system. Here's some stuff about me and how I'm a pretty big deal. Okay, <laughs> obviously I'm just kidding. Um, I just want you to know that I do have a lot of experience trying the stuff on myself and working on shows. This is not something that I just thought of yesterday and made a course. And finally here, I just want to provide some alternatives that you could choose instead of this course, right? Um, you could potentially go to a university and you could pay $40,000, spend four years and get no guaranteed results. Another option might be to go to a seminar or class like we talked about before. And that total cost to you could be anywhere between $750 and $2,000. And I say up to $2,000 because I recently spent $2,000 to fly to another city so that I could take this exact kind of thing. So these are real numbers from my own experience. And it might cost you only 10 days and maybe you'll get some real world experience, but you definitely won't get guaranteed results. So maybe you can see where I'm going with this, but the other two options that you have are doing it yourself, which is what most people default to because they don't even know that these kind of options are available. Again, no guaranteed results, but this is the best place for getting real world experience. And then finally, Another common choice is do nothing because we don't know what the options are. Why am I mentioning the guaranteed results? Well, because it's in Priority Workshop Scene Sound that you do have a guarantee. And that guarantee is basically that I want you to 
try the course and see if it works for you. I know that this is sort of a weird thing. It's not like you can go into a store, pick up an orange and smell it and you're like, this orange smells good, I'll buy this. Or you go into another store and you look at a microphone, let's say, and then you say, this microphone looks great, I can actually listen to it, I'll buy this microphone. It's not the same with an online course, right? That's why the guarantee. So I want you to try it out for 30 days, kick the tires, you know, try and break it, see if it works for you. And all that I ask is that you um, do all the lessons and the homework for the first two modules. And you, if you still haven't seen any results, any changes in your confidence and consistency, please ask for a refund because it's definitely not for you, okay? Bunch of frequently asked questions here, so let's get into those quickly. How long is the course? You have lifetime access to it. It takes most people about six months, but I don't really care, as I mentioned. It could take you a year, it could take you a week, it doesn't matter. No, this course is not just about line arrays. There are um, lessons on aim and splay for line arrays, but there's a lot of other lessons about single speakers, uh, smaller events, bigger events. And the important thing to understand here is that speakers in a room, speakers in a room, okay? So if you are working in corporate events, this will work for you. If you're working in concert sound, if you're working in theater, if you're working in stall, it doesn't matter because the physics of audio are always the same. Are the lessons live or pre-recorded? Um, so 58 pre-recorded video lessons. And then every two weeks we have a live meeting that I call the office hours. And that's where you can bring all of your questions and we can um, look at them live as a group, get everybody's feedback. Do you need to have smart? No, you don't. You do need to have some kind of audio analyzer, but I don't care what you use. Sat live, smart, SysTune, Rita, I don't know, there's, there's a bunch of audio analyzers out there. It doesn't really matter. As long as it can make a transfer function, you'll be fine. Again, you don't need to buy any of these immediately. There are free options available and you can always get the demo versions, the trial versions of the software to get started before you make a decision. You do need an audio analyzer at some point, um, but you don't need to spend a lot of money on it right away. And in fact, please do not spend a lot of money on it right away. Um, spend as little as possible to get the job done. Will this course teach me smart? No, this is not a smart course. Okay, if you want to learn smart, please go take a course with Rational Acoustics. They're great. That being said, I use smart. There's a lot of people in the course who do use smart. So if you're in the course and you have a question about smart, most likely we'll be able to answer it. Will you get a certificate? Yes, it looks like this you can then add it to your LinkedIn profile and it will have a URL where your certificate will live forever. What's great about that is that you can always prove that you have this certificate. So even if I get hit by a bus tomorrow and the website gets taken down, you'll still have the certificate um, where it will live at a permanent address. Sometimes people that can't pay with PayPal or credit card, which are the two main payment gateways I have set up. If you wanna send me Bitcoin or um, you don't even have a bank account or you wanna use something like TransferWise, that's totally fine. Just reach out to me, um, send me an email, nathan at sounddesignlive.com or you know, send me a message here and we will figure it out. What's the bottom line here? I created this course because I care deeply about your growth as an audio engineer and your satisfaction with your work. I struggled for a long time. It was a long, difficult climb for me to get to a place where I am now where I feel like I have some mastery over some of these topics and it's really helped me in my work and I wanna help you do the same thing but in hopefully a faster, more efficient manner. Okay, here are the two packages you have available. Standard and accelerated. What's the difference? Basically accelerated just gives you more stuff. So the accelerated package has everything that's in the standard package all the lessons, um, the bi-weekly office hours that I mentioned, the 30-day guarantee, lifetime access to all the lessons. But it includes some extra stuff if you are a person that wants to really move quickly. So probably the most valuable parts are number one, four one-on-one -on -one private trainings with me. So if you wanna meet um, every week for your first month in the course to really get you moving quickly, this could be helpful for you. And if you are a person that wants an extra six months of support 
and maybe you want to do the course over a year or you want to go all the way through it and then go through it again. However you want to handle that, this could be helpful for you as well. And then there's a few more fun bonus items here like a three-month membership at Soul Sound and annual membership to um, Pro Audio Mastermind. And then you'll see here that you also have a couple of ways to pay for this. Now you could pay for these in full, $497 for the standard package, $997 for the accelerated, or I also offer a monthly payment plan that I personally finance. You could get started for just $97 a month. This is a long video, but I really wanted to get into a lot of the details of this page. The page is long, has a lot of information here. But I made a lot of this with, with care, you know, and I want to give you as much information about the course as possible to let you know what it is um, and if it's the right thing for you. So just to recap here, Proteo Workshop Seeing Sound, what is it? It is an online sound system tuning course. And is it right for you? Well, if you are a live sound engineer and you would like to improve your confidence and consistency so that you can be delivering the same awesome mix that you're creating in your mix console to every seat in the audience, then yes, I believe this will be helpful for you. If you have any questions over anything that I talked about in this video, please just comment below. Sound Design. Live.